Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the n integers as the input and then print the count of triplets where the three integers are in strictly descending that is decreasing order the order of the triplets must be in the same order of input and that's the note given to us so first we are going to accept the n integers as the input and print the count of triplets where the three integers are in strictly decreasing order and we have also given a note that the order of triplets must be in the same order of input so now we will take our first test case so here we have five integers and now let's find the possible triplets without changing the order in 7 to 1 and after that 7 to 8, 7 8 3 then after that 7 8 1 and then 7 sorry 2 8 3 and then 2 8 1 and then 2 3 1 and then 8 3 1 so these are the possible triplets in this test case so now we have to find the triplet with decreasing order so here it is 7 to 1 so here it is true and then and then here also that is here we missed a triplet that is 731 and that is true so after that here it is 831 this is also true because it is in decreasing order so now the count of the triplets in decreasing order is 3 so 3 will be our output Now let us implement our program. First we'll get the input, the total number of integers and then we'll get the n integers as array list and then we'll have a variable called count equal to zero which will store the count of the triplets which is in decreasing order so and this will be our final output so now in order to find the possible triplets we'll have three for loops so for in two in range zero in one plus n one plus one comma n and then for in three in range in two plus one comma n so these three for loops will give us the possible triplets and here we check the condition that is if the array of in1 is greater than the array of in2 and the array of in2 is greater than the array of in3 then we are going to increment the count by 1 and finally we'll print the count as our output 
so here the in one represents the first integer and then in two represents the second integer and in three represents the third integer so now let us run our program we'll pass our first test case yes we have got the correct output that is there are three triplets in decreasing order And then we'll pass our second test case. And here also we have got the correct output. Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.